Hi guys, Pink Vision Tarot here. I thought I'd do another reading, just a general reading. Spray a bit of Palo Santo um, spray. General readings, take what resonates, leave the rest. Archangel Michael, Spirit Guides and Ancestors. Um, we just need some messages, just a heads up for the collective. So they could be about personal lives, they can be about world events, they can be about celebrities, they can be about politicians, they can be about your auntie or your uncle. We want just messages for anyone who's might come across this video. And just so that you guys know, I mean I'm only doing these videos now just on my phone, so they're not great quality, so I apologise, but um, yeah, my laptop doesn't record anymore for some reason. So what do we need to know? What do we need to know? Random. Right. First message, first card. What have we got? The hangman. So we've heard this a couple of times. Um, obviously, it's just if you think about the traditional hangman. Um, but looking at this person, someone might be wanting to get into fitness, someone might be wanting to get into something, if you're a little bit, hey, if you're a little bit older, you might want to get into some exercise that's a little bit more gentle on the body, so there might be someone older that's just thinking about some exercise now, because physical health, mental health is really important, uh, so someone could be thinking about um, getting into light exercise, which would be really good for you, whether it be walks, or, you know, there's, you know, with YouTube, there's some beginner lessons for everything from pilates to yoga um even meditation so that could be um on the horizon or someone's just in limbo at the moment not knowing what to do should i take that job should i move what should i do i think clarity is coming soon for a lot of people this is quite a bright card i think clarity is coming you'll know what to do so it could be someone wanting to get physically more active and, and healthy but without straining themselves too much or it could be the fact that, you know, someone's been in limbo for a long time and they're going to finally find some clarity. What else do we have? Five of cups, five of chalices. So, you know, feeling left out, uh, feeling drained, I would say. Someone could be drinking too much. That could be another thing. Someone could be waking up hungover quite a bit. Could be um, a five-day bender. Could be something to do with five. But emotional. Someone could have a family member. Yeah, someone could be battling addiction. Just I just looking at this card with this sort of this sort of the heavenly figure, and then this looks a little bit more, I'd say, demonic. Or uh, there's an addiction. Someone has an addiction. You even see a Star of David at the bottom there. Interesting. So someone could be battling addiction um, and, and they're not doing that well. And they're fighting, you know, fighting themselves. Because when you're addicted, you know, you don't really care about what anyone else thinks. It's just some you're fighting, you're fighting yourself. So there could be a message for someone that, you know, someone's not ready to get help yet. Um, when they are, hopefully they'll come, but they're battling at the moment. Seven of Wands. Hmm. Interesting. Um, so, Seven of Wands, uh, this could be just looking at the cards too. It's not just about what, it's about what the cards show you. So, I just heard someone could be changing career. Or someone could be now deciding later in life, I might start studying and become a teacher or um, do something more academic. So there could be a change in career. Um, there could be messages coming in for someone. There could be someone applying for lots of jobs. Maybe they need to start cold calling at the moment because, you know, that all their CVs that they're emailing and they're not getting any hits on those. A, a bit of a magical, I just heard magic, be, be mindful, you know, there are a lot of people out there that practice magic, and it's, um, you just have to be careful practicing magic, guys, so if you're not well trained, you know, just doing witchcraft is, um, can conjure up things um, that are hard to get rid of, so just be mindful of that, uh, 
so you've got the justice card reversed i don't like um something just said just something just came to me saying i don't like this i don't like that so someone might not be happy with the outcome of a situation someone might not be ha happy with the outcome of a court hearing i uh, could be civil family um just some kind of criminal court Someone might not be happy with the decision someone's made or the government have made or their family have made. There is a feeling of something's happened that's not right, that's not just. So that could be coming up. It could be in the workplace, could be just through your local government. Something isn't just. There could be a judge that's caught out doing the wrong thing. There could be a judge that makes a decision that is not what... Um, the judgment should have been so there could be a verdict coming in for someone soon look red shoes you we all know about the red shoe club uh bill clinton the red shoes epstein's island there could be a judge that's linked to epstein island that um could be working on a case now that gets uncovered a judge could be um named in court documents to do with a, a celebrity uh, knave of wands so that could be um, just a pretty young thing so there could be you know your daughter I personally have a redhead daughter um, so this could be a young child that's you know doing things a bit silly or being very adventurous um, sometimes that's a good thing um, they might just be discovering themselves, learning more about themselves. They might be doing something that is a little bit out of their depth. And they don't quite realise it now. But again, they will start realising it. Lots of different messages. It could be a young person drinking too much. Queen of Cups reverse. So this is an emotionally very draining situation or person. It could be a mother figure, a boss or a female that's an alcoholic and it's affecting everyone. Um, there could be a female figure that's an alcoholic that um, loses her addiction to alcohol. She could be found by a family member. Yeah, this is unfortunate. If this is the case, let's see what else comes along. But sometimes, you know, not everyone can be saved and not everyone can change. We like to think people can, but not everyone can change. And the Four of Cups reverse. So, yeah, I feel like someone could have a major alcohol problem to the point where they, um, they can't. Someone's not going to be able to recover from alcoholism. And then someone else is finally seeing that there's something else on the horizon. They've been holding on to something and they're finally realising there's something else out there that could be better. So a few messages. The sun reverse. So yeah, it could be a family um, member, I think, that's struggling with addiction and, and that addiction could take cost them. Um, could be a falling out with your family too. Could be a falling out with some kids or young people or young people causing a bit of trouble in the neighborhood king of wands depicted as a female there mm. what are they talking about lately uh, bohemian grove um talking about witchcraft here um if you are into witchcraft just looking at this getting the messages that i get you, you know what i see and the messages i get are from me you know that that's what i see and what comes to my head you know, witchcraft, as I said earlier, is dangerous. It's dangerous. And you need to be really careful what you want to put out. It's, you know, it's dangerous, you know, just hiring someone to do witchcraft for you. Be very careful because witches used to be burned on the stake. And, you know, sac people sacrifice. And if you think that's not real, you need to wake up because there is a lot of people out there that sacrifice, whether they do animals for rituals or whether they do humans. It happens, it's real, and maybe something is highlighted about a female that does, you know, rituals or, um, hey, Beyonce could be named. She's blonde at the moment. Anyway, uh, Nine of Pentacles. So money, money coming in. Some wishes, I think. 
a lot of hard work, a lot of people, this also could be a boss that's got a lot of people that's working really hard for them and, and um, they're looking out to what they can see but they're not looking down to say thank you, thank you. Could be a boss that's not exactly grateful for what they have or grateful for the staff they have so you might not feel gratitude but that could change. I'm, I'm hoping if it is a boss that's not very grateful you will um, be rewarded. Maybe there's a bonus coming up that you don't even realise. Um, six of Wands reverse. So, you know, Six of Wands is victory. It's it's um, acknowledgement. Public accolades. So someone could that has been held to high esteem um, could start um, coming down like a, a, few, a peg or two. And what have we got there? The Three of Cups reverse. So no celebration here. You know, the, I think just with there's quite a few cups, I think there's definitely alcoholism that's um someone's going to let you know that they're alcoholic or someone's going to that you know that is an alcoholic or is abusing some kind of substance will it, it will take them out i think yeah penis was raised i think um some people sink and some people swim and see the moon there and again, even with these, you know, dancing around the fire, I, I feel there is a lot of witchcraft out there. So maybe do some protection, you know, cover yourself in a white light of healing. You know, some people, words can be, words can um, affect you or affect other people. So, you know, no weapons formed against me shall prosper. So there might be some witchcraft happening in the background somewhere or someone you know is doing witch, witchcraft. Um, just be mindful of what people are trying to do. Feels like it could be female energy, not, not like a warlock, just a female that's doing witchcraft or a female that's paying for witchcraft. You know, jealousy can um, cause people to do really stupid things. So I thought, again, like I did before, uh, an oracle for um, the star signs. Okay. So what do fire signs need to, to know? Aries Leo said. What do star, um, fire signs need to know? Aries Leo said. Fire signs. Oh, that just wanted to flip out. Financial discipline. Um, important. Um, we are a... Um, generation of consumers we consume 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 less is more less is more sometimes we don't need to have something new when we can buy something secondhand or we can live without it we don't always need everything we have in our house so some financial discipline um, could be on the cards uh, just to help you or for someone else you know a fire sign that's you know hasn't been very good with money and you may be losing money for other people. They might start facing some financial karma. So air signs, Aquarius, Libra, and Gemini. Aquarius, Libra, and Gemini. Domestic harmony. Oh, oh so that threw, flew out of my hand, so someone might want to disrupt that. But domestic harmony, this is what we want. We want, you know, a move that goes smoothly and maybe a coming to a property or a place that is uh, more in line with who you are. And, you know, furniture, things, jewellery, places have energy. So maybe just, um, you know, things are starting to really um, come together for you, and I think that's great. Water signs, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Water signs, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Leadership. So water signs, you could be in a position of power. You should you could be, you know, the person that wants to study because you want a more senior role somewhere. Uh, you want a more academic uh, role. So leadership's really important for you, or you have a great leader, or you are a great leader. Earth signs, what do you need to know? Capricorn Taurus and Virgo. Capricorn Taurus and Virgo. Uh, earth signs, what do you need to know? Earth signs, earth, earth, earth. That one. Spiritual career. So for some of you, you know, you might be getting into uh, 
well, this could be someone here um, is practicing witchcraft. All I can say, if you're going to do that, be very careful, please. Be very careful. Because I have a friend that's um, had a hard time after um, practicing witchcraft. So please be careful what you conjure up. Um, if you want to read tarot or do some kind of spiritual healing, um, you should go for it because this is affirmation that it's um, the right thing to do or that you have a gift. So I just might, I just was told to do maybe one or two of these little oracles for clarification. What do we need to know just as a collective, as a collective, just a couple of clarifiers. What's, what else is going on? As a collective, um, misfortune. Okay, there's a fire. Um, I think... Mm. To me, this is like the tower. So there could be a tower moment for someone. There could be a fire somewhere in a building. It could be a big building, people jumping out of buildings. There's something's going to happen that's quite chaotic. So this could be something in your, where you live. It could be you or it could just be in general. Almost like a general um, event that's happened that's around your area to say hey this this was right this reading was right if you know what I mean but you know we don't want fires there could be a bomb go off somewhere so there could be an, an event you know in a country I can't, I can't say where but there is like old-fashioned police hats so it could be um, could be London there could be a bomb go off or a big fire in London one more And room. So room's just another card that sort of talks about, I think, a place that's special to you. Or a room that's, that's significant. It looks a very um, fancy room. So this could be... This is a bit harder. This could be... It, this building so it could be an old building see the windows are similar where you've got the they're cracking but they are like the panes that so there could be an old building that's on fire and inside you have some relics or old furniture that's um that is burnt or it could start from a lamp or a fire from a candle or something like that but there's going to be possibly a, a fire in a property that's significant Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Any comments? Love to hear what you have to say. And I'll try and do another one tomorrow. Happy Easter.